Previously on Town Hall 8 Free to Play, troop funneling was the topic of interest leaving you fulfilled mm -hmm. with knowledge. Let's not forget the cheap farm army with major results. Today, we are going to use two different war armies with the hopes of six stars. <laughs> Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joe and welcome back for episode 12 of the Town Hall 8 free to play. Man, we are, it's clan war day. We're going to do some clan war attacks. We got dragon army cooked up right now. And then we have, let's see here. We got golems and hog riders and stuff cooked up after that. So we're going to go directly back to back, knock out two attacks in this video. Uh, but if you don't remember that giant army that we did yesterday, man, dude, we pulled some serious loot in the last 24 hours. I mean, we tapped out at like 6 million, and then I built a few things. I put some more spring traps down, and then I also forgot that I didn't build the other dark drill. The dark elixir drill. Who really needs it? I mean, we're at 77,000. We had 80,000 dark elixir before I cooked the golems, so, I mean, who really needs drills, right? But... Anyways, if you're a non-believer of the giant army, make sure you check it out and try it out for yourself because the loot is there in the gold league. Don't 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 discredit it until you try it. Just saying. Just <laughs> All right, so anyways, clan games. Paradox Reloaded. You guys are monsters. You're absolute monsters, you beasts, and I'm absolutely proud to play with you because this is incredible. 53,000 points in the last day and a half. I, it, it, that's incredible. I haven't even finished my own. Like, we're not even close to 4,000 yet, and I got this one right here for clan war and then we're going to finish that up and see what happens but let's go ahead and show some numbers here we got some people here that put up 4,000 points and i want to share their names they are awesome dark shadow zinni uh elite pac-man general dip and miss lisa putting in work guys you guys are amazing and then the rest of them are putting in some serious work as well or at least we're trying to but i mean we're done we don't even really need to do anymore right all right, so anyways, that is going to finish that up, and let's go ahead and do our question of the day. Question of the day is, uh, it's AA13. Now, he says it's his birthday. I really hope that he's not lying. It actually is his birthday, so happy birthday. Uh, question of the day, today is my birthday, and my question for you is this. Is Gohobo a good strategy for Town Hall 8 pushing? Two golems, 19 hogs, and bowlers in the clan castle. Ah, pushing. I don't know about pushing, man. It seems like a really good attack strategy for Clan War versus other Town Hall 8s, but I just don't see that being very good against Town Hall 9s. Have any of you other people used it? Because I don't feel that that's a very good strategy versus Town Hall 9s. You got to remember, when you start pushing, you get up into the Crystal League, you start working into Masters, you're going to start facing off against Town Hall 9s. And as you continue to continuously push, you're going to start facing tougher Town Hall 9s, even some might be maxed out. So I just don't see the bowlers being enough. I think it's only like, what, three or four that you can carry in a clan castle. And then 19 hogs being against Expos and stuff. I just don't see it working out i definitely recommend the golems and valkyrie army but that's just me i'm sure there's going to be some other postings and comments down in the comments below that say try this but anyways if you have a comment or a question of your own hashtag question of the day and if you enjoy the content guys make sure you throw up a big fat thumbs up i do greatly appreciate it and let's go ahead and get into clan war so we got our dragon army and we're going to just we're just going to pick one guys we're just going to straight up yolo let's see what we got on the map here i'm not going to search too long we just got to get these attacks done looks like we got a clan castle up top looks like eh, not bad uh sweeper off to the left not too bad right dragon army we gotta remember we got a dragon army so we're gonna need to make sure that we get in on those air defenses you know what i don't even care <laughs> you know what who actually gets scared about clan war attacks who gets all jittery and stuff do you guys get jittery and stuff like oh my goodness it's gonna be so bad <laughs> i don't really get like that anymore so it's been a while uh since we've done a clan war it's been a couple of days but we're just gonna go for it let's not talk about it too much so 10 dragons three rage spells we got poison spell balloons in our clan castle king and our haste spell let's do it so we're going to come in on the back side of the sweeper and we're going to flank with our balloons or at least try to so let's go ahead and use our king let's use a king down here because you know that the clan castle is going to get pulled up here in the top of the base uh doesn't look like there's any builder's huts other than on the opposite side of the base so the king is going to walk his way down towards the south and it doesn't look like there's any point defenses really in that region now look he's gonna get caught up on the wall look at this guy man nope there's an army camp literally like three tiles away from this guy and he's gonna totally go in at the in the wall okay that's really nice right all right so let's go ahead and drop a dragon over here start working on the buildings over there we're gonna drop one up here let's go ahead and spread some of those out 
Okay, so we got dragons moving into an enemy dragon. Let's go ahead and drop a rage spell in that location and help those guys out. And then we got dragons working in right here. And let's go ahead and see if we can flank in some balloons into the south side air defense. So let's go ahead and drop our haste spell, launch the balloons in, and they're going to go into the base, go up into a hidden Tesla location. Let's go drop a rage spell there, get them down into that mortar, and then they're going to split off and go into two different locations. So you got one down there. Oh, no, come on. <laughs> no. Uh, you know, it, it is what it is, right? So we got one air defense. We got the balloons. They're coming back around. Oh. Yes, they're going to do it. All right. So dragons are going to go into the final archer tower and... Oh my gosh, you know they're going to go after the cannon. They're going to go after the cannon. There's one more defense remaining, and we got a minute and 25 seconds remaining. One minute and 22 seconds. And you know, and you know that we're, <laughs> we're going to run out of time here. So here's the thing. If that king would have followed the wall down and taken out these buildings, we wouldn't have had this problem. But it's okay. You know what? It is totally okay. We got plenty of attackers to get in here and three-star this base. I'm not tripping. But I'm going to get clan castle troops. We're going to get into the next attack, guys. All right. So let's go ahead and try to redeem ourselves a little bit. It's okay. You can mess up every once in a while. I mess up. It's not that big of a deal. And I know some of you guys are going ham on me down in the comments below. It's all right, though. We only got level two dragons anyway. So, I mean, doing the best we can with what we got. But that's the thing. Like, shake it off, get back in there, and do it again. You know what I mean? We got a different army this time around, though. We got the golems, valkyries, hog riders. We got minions, you know, wizards, and stuff like that. And then we're going to go in on this base right here. Not maxed out. We're not maxed out anyways. We got level one. Valkyries are not that strong. But we do have a clan castle that we need to pull out of the base. And we also have items on the outsides of the base. We got two camps and we have a builder's hut over there in the corner. So we need to make sure that we come in and take care of that barbarian king and uh, the clan castle troops. So I think we're going to lure. Let's go ahead and pull the clan castle out right about down here. So we're going to send some hogs in on this mortar. And then we're going to bring the dragon out and bring it to the edge of the base. We're going to do a little bit of clan castle luring, luring, if you will. Actually, we could probably do it right here. It doesn't really matter. Let's go ahead and get in here and take care of this base. It shouldn't be too difficult, but <laughs> you already saw how the last one turned out. So let's see how this one pulls off. We got everything. Let's go ahead and get back in there. And we're going to send one single hog in to pull the clan castle out. Hopefully he makes it. Let's get in there. Pull. The there you go. Good job, little buddy. All right, so we're going to pull the dragon and the balloon all the way to the edge of the base. And let me go ahead and adjust my microphone. And let's go ahead and grab that max level poison and get ready to go. So poison spell down for our dragon. And let's go ahead and drop some wizards. And let's drop the king. King is going to pull that balloon. Wizards are going to take care of the dragon. And that king is going to distract that balloon till it dies. All right, so we're good. There we go. Let's drop our, our golem and our golem and let's drop some wizards and let's open up this compartment for our wall breakers. King needs to be used. His ability needs to be used. And it looks like the wall breakers have opened up the compartment for our Valkyries and it looks like the wizards have cleaned up a nice wide funnel on the opposite side. So Valkyries are going to go into the base. Let's go ahead and drop some wall breakers and open up the compartment for our Valks. Actually, it looks like the Valks are going to go around. Let's keep an eye on those real quick. All right, so Valkyries are going to cut through the wall. Let's go ahead and cut it with the Rage Spell. We're going to drop the Rage Spell there for them. And looks like the defenses have distracted everything. So let's go ahead and send our Hogs in now. Hogs are going to go after that hidden Tesla down into that bomb tower. And we got Hogs moving into the backside of the defenses. Double Cannon, uh, uh, Wizard Tower. I had to think about that. And it looks like the final defense is in the Archer Tower and the Air Sweeper. So we don't even need this other heal spell. We'll do a little bit of swag there. Let's go ahead and drop the Archer and the Minion up there to assist with taking down these final two defenses. And that was actually quite simple. So actually, believe it or not, with the clan castle, you can either bring Valkyries or you can bring high level hog riders. Really your choice. It doesn't really matter. The Valkyries absolutely destroyed this base. Oh! 
it wasn't maxed out anyways, but we're not maxed out. Our hog riders are level two and our Valkyries are level one. So we did redeem ourselves. We got the three star on that base, but the previous attack, woo! <laughs> not exactly my idea of a good time. And it normally helps to hold on to a dragon when you're doing dragon attacks. Don't use all of them. I happen to just use all of them like a not very smart individual, but there we go with that. We got five out of the six stars, not a bad gig. And I think we're going to go out there and cook the rest of our army. Actually, I think we're going to cook up another. Oh, no, 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 no. We don't need to cook that. I'm going to pull that out. But anyways, that's going to pretty much wrap us up for today, guys. I just want to do clan war hits today and show you two different armies. Unfortunately, one of those was unsuccessful, but you guys know how to use the dragons. And if you don't, make sure you drop it down in the comments below and let us know. And if you enjoyed the content today, smash that like button, subscribe if you haven't done so already. And we'll see you in the next one, guys. Take care.